Happy Monday. I am um, feeling pretty good today. I feel like I look really tired, but I felt really good. I slept really good last night. Only woke up one time. Um, yeah, that breakfast was really good. Really, really good. But alrighty, well, work of course is just going, starting off with a bang. So I'm going to get to it. Um, I will see you guys at lunchtime. Hey guys, I am making a sandwich. I um, wanted to let you know, which you probably already noticed um, by clicking on this video, <laughs> that we only have one day in this video. And so work is starting to get busy again. Um, I have just a lot of things coming up with work. Now that we're going back to um, in-person orientations, um, our whole team gets together once a month for those, and those are on a Wednesday. And then um, we have some trainings coming up because it's getting to be the time of year for school districts where we kind of transition over to the next school year. So we're starting to work on that kind of stuff. And so my um, work is just going to be getting a lot busier now as, um, the days go on. I also have a conference I'm going to have to attend in May and um, that's at the end of, towards the end of May. And then we're doing all of our schedules and calendars and stuff all the way um, from May 1st on. So the videos with more than one day in it for what I eat in a day um, take a lot more time to edit add in the food, um, do any voiceovers I need to do, those kind of things, um, and just the any recipes that I'm sharing, um, that kind of stuff. It just takes a lot more time to edit, and I'll be working 40 plus hours um, a week 
more than likely as we go on. And plus, I'm just going to be kind of a lot more mentally exhausted. <laughs> so, um, over the next couple of months, G July will calm down a little bit. Although, I do have to go to a conference in July as well. But July will calm down a little bit. But May and June are probably just going to be just super crazy. Um, I... I should say April, May, and June. Um, my plan is to do for sure one day, and then if I and then edit that one, get it uploaded, and then if I have time or I feel like I'm going to have the time to edit and the capacity, mental capacity to edit it, then I will um, do another one um, in the week. But I just don't want to give any promises, so. My goal is to film on Mondays if those are the days that works out, depending on the conferences. Like the conference I have to go to in the end of May is um, like a Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. So the day I'll probably record will probably be on Wednesday. Um, but I need to give myself like a day in between to edit and all that. So like this is Monday. So this will probably go up on Wednesday. And then if I can, I know this Wednesday I can't record because that'll be the one of the days that we are um, as a team getting together and I'm um, going to probably be a full day thing. Um, but I will try to record tomorrow if it looks like I'll have time to edit and then get that up on, um, Thursday or Friday. So I'm just going to just take it day by day, but just so you know, that's the reason why I'm, you know, things may change just a little bit. I'll try to plan the, um, the videos to be at least days where maybe if I'm trying a new recipe or something like that, then I can make sure I'm sharing that with you. Um, those kind of things. I'll just try to time it just right. I feel like this week I can probably do two videos, but we'll just, we'll just go from there. Um, let me go ahead and show you my lunch. I'm going to make a sandwich out of the multi-green sandwich thins. I have one slice of the thin pepper jack, which I think a serving is three slices. I'm just using one slice. I have some of the Sara Lee oven roasted turkey, which is zero points by the way. Um, so I have one slice of that because these are, look how big these slices are, they're huge. And then I'm gonna do some pickles. I, I just added mustard on my sandwich. And then I have a hard boiled egg. And then I'm also going to pair that with some apple straws. So let me go and get this all together and I will turn around and show you. There is my lunch. So we have one of those multigrains with my turkey and my cheese, pickles, a hard boiled egg with some everything but the bagel seasoning, um, four little cherry tomatoes. That's all I had left from last week. I forgot to pick up more this week. And then we have some apple straws. These things are absolutely amazing. So that is my lunch. I'm gonna pack it up and take it back to work. Okay, time for a little snack. For dinner tonight, I'm going to have the chicken and gravy that I meal prepped yesterday. So I'll do a serving of this and a serving of the mashed cauliflower that I made with cottage cheese. It turned out really well. It was kind of a happy accident. So I'm gonna have that, I'm gonna heat it up and I'll show you what it looks like. And here is my dinner. Alrighty guys, I am going to end my day with one of these two good remix yogurts. I have been really hungry today. This morning I was so busy, I got my pancakes eaten, did not get a chance to eat my yogurt. Then, but before I knew it, it was 12.04. I don't even know where the day went. Came home, ate my lunch, went back to work, had those veggies and hummus. I thought about having my yogurt, but then I just, again, got super busy, but I was so hungry today. I wish I would have got my yogurt out, but dinner was really good. So I ate dinner as soon as I got home from work, earliest dinner ever. And, um, and now I'm kind of just wanting something a little bit more. So I'm gonna try this blueberry and what's it called? Blueberry Almond Oat Crisp. I've not tried this one. Out of all the remixes, the Too Good and the Dan and Light and Fit are my favorite. Do not like the Oikos ones, they're just too sweet. I would say though the Too Good are probably my favorite, but there's just, my stores don't have a whole lot of variety of flavors. So I'll probably go between these ones and the Dan and Light and Fit ones, but 
still be this. I am finishing up another one of these pineapple tangerine bubbly bursts. I drank one yesterday of this flavor. So good. I'm so glad I picked up two of these flavors. Um, I have not tried the watermelon lime, which a lot of you told me that that's your favorite. So drink this, eat this, end my day. I will put right up here or I'll put like maybe on the next slide what my um, points works. I'm not sure where I'm at right now. I kind of stopped after lunchtime. I forgot to put everything else in. So not sure where I'm at in points or calories or protein, but I will put that on the next slide and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.